Once upon a time in the year Ek at Shunno, in a small village nestled among rolling hills, lived a curious and bright young boy named Oliver. Oliver loved exploring the world around him, learning new things, and asking questions that made the adults scratch their heads, but there was one thing that made Oliver feel a little nervous, going to school. The school was located in a grand old building on the other side of the village, and Oliver had to walk there all by himself. Every morning, he would wake up, see the schoolhouse in the distance, and feel a bit of unease in his heart. One sunny morning, as Oliver prepared to head to school, he discovered a magical feather on his windowsill. It shimmered with a golden hue and seemed to beckon him with a gentle whisper. Oliver, have courage, for your journey to knowledge awaits. Intrigued by the feather's enchanting message, Oliver tucked it safely into his pocket and set off on his path. As he walked through the village, he noticed familiar faces. Other children his age who were also on their way to school. Some seemed excited, others a little hesitant. Just like him, as they approached the school, Oliver's heart raced with anticipation. The building stood tall and majestic, and then in a sense of wisdom and adventure. Oliver hesitated for a moment, but then he remembered the magical fever in his pocket. It reminded him to have courage and embrace the unknown. Stepping through the doors, Oliver discovered a world unlike any he had ever known. The classrooms were filled with books, maps, and eager students. The teacher, Ms. Anderson, welcomed him warmly and encouraged him to find his place among his fellow classmates. As days turned into weeks, Oliver's unease slowly transformed into excitement. He realized that school was not just a place of learning, but a gateway to endless possibilities. He discovered the joy of reading captivating stories, the thrill of solving mathematical puzzles, and the wonder of conducting exciting science experiments. Oliver's newfound knowledge became a source of pride and confidence. He started to share his discoveries with his family and friends, sparking their curiosity as well. His parents were overjoyed to see their little boy blossoming into a knowledgeable young lad. One day, as Oliver looked back on his journey, he realized that the magical feather had played a vital role in shaping his path. It had reminded him that courage was not about the absence of fear but rather about faith. Facing his fears hidden with a grateful heart, Oliver decided to share the magical feather with others who were embarking on their own journeys to knowledge. He placed the feather on a small pedestal in the school's entrance, where it became a symbol of bravery and encouragement for all who passed by. From that day forward, the village's children were filled with courage as they embarked on their journey to school. The magical feather reminded them that knowledge was a treasure waiting to be discovered, and with a curious mind and a brave heart, they could conquer any challenges that came their way, and so, the small village thrived with a generation of bright minds, all because of the courage and curiosity that flourished in the hearts of children like Oliver, the true heroes of their own stories.